Hello, my name is Steve Lundy and I'm with SBK and Associates. In this presentation, I'm going to demonstrate the functionality in the PTC Integrity 2 Windchill Integration. The purpose of the PTC Integrity 2 Windchill Integration is to pick up documents authored in PTC Integrity Lifecycle Manager and move them into Windchill. What I'm going to do next is to actually show how that happens. The first thing we're going to do is take a look at this design specification that I have up on the screen right now. It's a simple document. We have a document container here, as well as some document content items. The first thing we need to do is we go to the document item type and we go to the windchill tab. Here we have all the information that we need to know in terms of the integration to windchill. The first thing we notice is that the integration status set to never send to windchill. When we want to send something to windchill, the first thing we need to do is to select the windchill location. So I click on this link and I log in to windchill. User ID and password. Submit. Now what I've done here is I've created some destinations for various documents ahead of time. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to select one of these destination documents. In this case my design specification. I'm going to say select. And now I can publish this document to Winchell. I can get rid of this. So the next thing I'm going to do, I'm ready to push this document to windchill. So that's where I use the send to windchill field. I select start, say OK. In order to kick everything off, I save the changes to the document using a control S. I'll just auto resolve any changes and away it goes. We give it a few minutes. Currently the integration status is set to in progress. We will update what's going on, a couple minutes, it'll be done. Okay, now you notice that the integration status is set to completed. This means that the document has been successfully pushed to Windchill and is currently located in Windchill. If we scroll down, we can see a link here to, to link to the item within Windchill. I can control click on this link. And log in. And this brings us to our design specification. Okay. And here you can see our main specification, Steve Lundy's design specification document, and then all the different content items that make up that uh, document. Before I uh, wrap up this demonstration, I want to discuss the limitations of the PTC Integrity to Windchill integration. The first thing that you need to know is that all documents must be authored in Integrity to be sent to Windchill. You can't send documents from Windchill back into Integrity. Second, all changes to the document must be done in Integrity. The original intent for this was a one-way push of Integrity items into Windchill. In conclusion, I hope this demonstration has been informative. If you wish to learn more about PTC Integrity Lifecycle Manager or other products, please check out our website. Also, check out our blogging site. Thank you.